Hi everyone, Sandra from For Your Chi. This is your weekly tarot and oracle card reading for May 8th, or excuse me, May 6th of 2024. Thanks for being here. Um, recording this late, sorry about that. There are there have been distractions. Uh, but I cannot let one le week slide because when I do, I get messages from you that are begging me to upload this reading. Okay, so in order to upload, I have to do it first, right? Monday and Tuesday now, we're looking at the past. As this is recorded on Wednesday, we have divine timing along with conflict and defeat. That's interesting. More conflict, for one, probably with the same person. Uh, could be with new people. The divine timing is interesting because that just speaks to what I just talked about when I said distractions. You are being distracted from something else that you intended to do so that you could come back to it later for reasons that are mysteriously unknown. However, the universe is controlling that. Now, your card for Wednesday, Thursday, crown chakra, along with forgiveness, you're being given downloads information that's coming in aha moments epiphany moments uh shower thoughts as reddit calls it this could be related to someone that you need to reach out to this could be a past someone this could be um, someone that you've been introduced to by a third party a mutual friend now, the forgiveness, obviously this could be someone in your past um, that, not the person, but the situation is requiring your forgiveness in order for you to move forward. But for many of you, this is going to be forgiving yourself for something. So, number one, pay attention to the messages that you're getting, get, getting in the form of downloads the aha, the epiphany moment, that type of thing, write it down. Especially if this download relates to someone or something surrounding forgiveness. This is going to be super important this week. For some of you, uh, you will need to do something to fix this in order to move forward and then once you do that, it will be like all of the blockages have been removed, released, and then it's pedal to the metal. Your weekend message, rest and rejuvenate with playfulness. You're going to be extra tired this weekend. It's important to get to bed early this weekend or to take a nap or all of the above. Um, with the playfulness, I feel like... For those of you who intended on getting some kind of work done, whether that's work at your job, work at the office, work around the house, or work around the yard, I feel like you it may benefit you to play some hooky there. Instead, maybe call a friend or hang out with someone that you enjoy and, um, you know, go grab your favorite ice cream or espresso or whatever suits you. Um, because there's something about pausing, taking a break, recharging your batteries, and also doing something that you find enjoyable. Not something that you find enjoyable that is self-destructive. Okay? Let's just get it all on the table. Thanks so much, everyone, for watching. Many blessings. Take care. If you haven't watched your May, please do. There was a lot of juicy tidbits of information that came out in May for all of you in the 12 zodiac signs. Take it easy.